All right, I want to do a video on my hanging squash experiment. So I wanted to try this. I mounted some L brackets on the south facing wall. This wall of my house faces directly south. Again, we are in Hillsborough County, Florida, zone 9B in Riverview, Florida. Um, it is late October, third week of October. And we're kind of right in the middle of our fall gardening season. Um, I planted, I didn't have enough room in my front garden. I wanted to try to figure out a way to be able to grow squash in such a way that I can maximize the space. Um, so squash, a lot of times I've grown it up stakes before, like grown it vertically, like single stemmed it up a stake. And I had some success doing that. But I felt like it's kind of fighting gravity to do that. They don't seem to they'll grow but I, I don't know if that's really the best way to do it I'm not sure I've had better luck letting my squash grow horizontally but things growing on the ground here is hard we have a lot a lot of pest pressure and disease pressure with the downy mildew and the powdery mildew it's moist and humid pretty much all year except for a couple maybe a couple of months out of the year. Um, we have humid, a lot of humidity at night. So growing things on the ground where it's real humid all the time is problematic um, with cucurbits especially. So this is a gold star squash seeds I got from a Haas Tools. Um, I mounted these brackets, these L brackets, about five feet off the ground up this south facing wall of my house and i'm growing that i planted that squash in there in the earth box um yeah, sometime in september Let's see the stem is coming out of just one one plant in there and the idea is just to let it come out and grow down you know and kind of let gravity pull the <laughs> pull the growing tip down um, I'm doing this, like I said, for a couple reasons. I can keep it off the ground. I can keep it, you know, maybe try to maximize my use of space. Because this is a spot where I don't grow anything, right? It's on the wall. But I can utilize it here. The air conditioner condenser is right here. This thing's running a lot. You get some wind over here which I think is drying out some of the leaves on that side, but I think it might also help dry the foliage out a little bit. I'm not sure. Um, but right now it's going as a success. It's also, again, on the south wall of my house. This is the warmest area of my yard. As you can see, I got a lot of tropicals over here, bananas and uh, star fruit, mango, papaya. So this is warm. This gets good direct sun in the afternoon up on this wall right here. This banana is shading it a lot, but as soon as this, I harvest this rack and it comes out, this will be getting really strong sun right here from the middle of the day all the way through the afternoon. So it will be a good spot in the future as well. And overall, so far it's been a success. I mean, the first few flowers didn't set, female flowers, but now I'm getting some pretty good set on here. Um, so we'll see. I think it's a viable way to do it and it's a spot that, so you could grow squash in a hanging type basket or a, on a vertically down, a, this draping down the side of a wall. It's just a, something that I wanted to try to prove concept. So check it out. 